tragic and grim, described the tone of proceedings as a 17-year-old stands trial, accused of killing three members of the Steenkamp family. But testimonies presented on Tuesday have added a lighter note, as the deceased's former employees recounted their activities on Good Friday last year. Even the accused struggled to stifle his laughter as several farm workers spoke candidly about their day off. After drinking an alcoholic ginger brew, some passed out at home and others at the police station. The laughter died down as the workers recalled how the accused had showed up screaming for help. They've told the court how they fled the farm and walked towards the town, still sipping on the homemade ginger concoction. The defense used the opportunity to point out the differences in their testimony, particularly about a white vehicle which some claimed to have seen speeding towards the farm on the day of the attack. Light was also shed on the bloodstains found on one of the workers' vehicles. One of the workers testified that he'd cut his hand while repairing the exhaust earlier that day. The trial is scheduled to run for the rest of the month. Earl Kutsia, Kimberley. News that moves. ENCA.com.